differentiate for us what am I going to be most upset about? Uh, you know, people are saying disinflation will stall. Then I've got another narrative, which is that super core cool may pop a little bit higher. What are you going to be super focused on? Well, I'm going to be focused on the market reaction because that helps drive the Fed. And I saw a headline that worried me this morning on the Bloomberg terminal. It says traders push stocks uh, futures up as they anticipate inflation cools. Uh, the forecast is for inflation to cool, particularly at the headline level, and to be unchanged at the core. But what if that is wrong? What if the core actually rises? Uh, that's not priced into the markets. And some yeah. of the people who think that uh, we could see a surprise today are leaning toward the idea that maybe on an unrounded basis we get a three-digit rise to uh, three point over five uh, percent uh, in, in terms of the uh, core on a month over month basis, which would push up the year over year to 4.2. And that could really cause a concern. And here's one of the reasons why. This is health insurance. Once a year, the okay. Bureau of Labor Statistics recalculates that. And you see how it was high for a year. And then for the last year, it's been negative and subtracting from CPI. This time, it is uh, likely to add to inflation pressures at the core level. So there are some concerns that we could get a negative surprise today.